Hey everyone, welcome to Small Screen Reactions. My name is Andrew and I'm here to react to Arrested Development Season 5, Episode 10. Very excited to watch this, you guys. Uh, before we enter it, though, please do not forget to go check out Patreon. Link down below in the description. Go to patreon.com slash smallscreenreactions. Uh, there you can watch <clears throat> future episodes of this show and all my other YouTube shows much earlier and fully uncut. Also, you can get Patreon-exclusive shows that if you're at the $10 tier or above, where shows that are only going to be on Patreon, not on YouTube at all, including Parks and Recreation, Attack on Titan, Battlestar Galactica, and multiple others. So go check that out, okay? Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoy this. And without further ado, here we go. <laughs> We're still doing this. So no one's chasing you guys. Hi, what do I do? Get in a funny business inside. Don't be a hero outside. Do I say hi? What do I do? Just say hi. In three, two, one. Hello. Hello. Ah. <laughs> Hurt you. Tell him the f off. F off, twinkle toes, tell him to F off. <laughs> Call the police. Oh my god. <laughs> Coming in from Ojai next Tuesday. Fun. Leaving with the inside. Three, two, one. Goodbye. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> Interest in really seeing his off. business. This reminds me, I'm dying to see it. He was desperate for a way out. Why don't you just tell Rebel? Yeah, it was maybe he so helped him for sure. They're paid protesters, boys. Unfortunately, you think they could be anonymous, like Guy Foxes? Jove had a different interpretation of what a guy yeah, obviously. was. Obviously, but pleasant surprise. Fake blog is incredible. Fake blog is... is real. Mm -hmm, yeah. So he went to cousin who was in the middle of her own deception. I was this oh. close to telling Rebel the whole truth, but you fired everyone months ago. Oh, uh, she's still doing this. She even wants to invest now. I don't know how you did it. But it was great. You got all those people there for the day. I didn't hire anybody. Oh. Who did that then? Where did all those, people? those people that you saw didn't come in for the day. They never left. They've been there the whole time working? I fired everybody. What I did was I asked Joan in HR to fire everybody for me. Oh. And then so I took phone calls and I just fired her right there on the spot. But then... I fired the person in charge of firing. But, so she didn't yeah, fire... <laughs> oh my God. Person Maybe. Person in HR left. That's so have these people not been paid at all? Is that right? I mean, we're still somehow paying all these people? Not paying Joan on HR. Gotta <laughs> give me credit for that one. Well, we're not no. gonna have any more at all. Well, that explains why maybe his credit cards aren't working. Uh. Maybe his credit cards? Oh, sorry. In the minute I put the teeth in, I become a completely different person. We can tell. Speaking of, there's your solution. We both have alter egos, and I think it's about time we killed them off. Oh, okay. Heart attack? Maybe gets hit by a bus? You're killing off maybe. Wait, Sia. maybe's you not know, your alternate. Forgetful, but she remembers that maybe is the dominant personality. Yeah. Hey, hey, Apparently not. Sweet set. Finally got rid of my beloved Stan. He's in the hospital. Massive. Well, pension. not anymore. Free rent. New neighbors every six to eight months. <laughs> so maybe my high school diploma. Not a good move, given the world my generation is leaving. Behind. That's true. Easy for you, but me and George Harris have the same teeth. <laughs> figure it out if i'm not arrested for fraud i'll be in debt for the rest of my life i'm gonna end up in my old yeah you're kind of screwed it's six o'clock i'm already an hour and a half late for dinner and i'm <laughs> sorry if i'm repeating annette you're like a pasta <laughs> how do you ever find me annette oh my god noise coming from his son's old bedroom and was surprised to discover that this time it was his son oh okay Throw the tennis ball against the wall, try and catch it, and then if I miss it, it's okay. I uh, feel pretty bad, and beat myself up, and then kind of try and look past that and get back on the horse. That sounds fun. What, what, what are you doing back in your old room? Um, that's just a minor regression. Minor regression. <laughs> uh, I guess I was actually just trying to go back to a simpler time when I was a young boy. Was it really that much simpler? things like what does it take to be a good citizen and am i going to be able to fall asleep tonight or am i getting myself too wound up about this good citizen stuff mm -hmm. michael you've always been funny little guy you know of course it makes sense now you being a computer genius speaking well, of which question is not no i sent it to the smile maker it's a dental printer that explains the toothbrush next to uh. the warning sign you see how they spelled bite without a y uh -huh. Now, this is for dentists. This is one of, this one of the billion dollar software company. No fantasy. No. Corn in the microwave and done like heat something up. You just hit uh -huh. heat and then hit time. And then just yeah, it's not rocket science to work yeah, a microwave. Make some of that. Come on. I kind of want popcorn now, too. Oil here, and the tinfoil's still here, but uh, I'm super confused. Do we have 
magic gummy bears that just get up and walk away. Oh god. Yeah, one got up and walked right into my mouth. <laughs> Oh, quarters had his makeshift family feeling on it. They're getting a little crazy. If I can go downstairs and go to the store. No, I'm the provider for this family. But then go to the store. Yeah, you're good at that, Dad. You're good at leaving. It's, it's kind of your thing, actually. Damn. Hey, I don't have to crap to you for that. Uh, again. I understand why we're still here. Yeah. Why are we laughing? I thought you said you were the sticky white glue that this family Sticky lives white glue. Together. Oh, <laughs> that situation here. But I've been jammed. Let's go to one of the other model homes. This. We just need better living conditions. The voiceover, that was bad. Isn't that what the booth company does? No, you fuck. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah. Oscar and Bob. There's a great path. And now, this is what we in the Bluth family call it. Don't tell Michael. <laughs> <laughs> but their new roommate wanted out. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know, boil some hot oil? <laughs> nice. Try, bitch. <laughs> nice try, try, bitch. <laughs> I love some. We could stay up late if you want and watch it. It's a net. I thought you said you lived here alone. My old lady, leave her out of it, would you please? She's a very sweet person. <laughs> She's smiling all the time, even when she sleeps. <laughs> my cue rising. <laughs> and in three, two, one. Inside, <laughs> it's ridiculous. Outside, outside. Oh my god, not the bottle. Run in it, run! Baby? Why did he tell you in that? Oh, oh god. Oh, oh! <laughs> and this is why I told you to buy the safety hair. <laughs> to erase memories, now I gotta drink the evidence. Back in the oh, mom, you got gotcha. you. You know, you're dating a girl in my dreams, your dreams. Did you know what I meant was yeah, that was no. Remember how we wanted to make sure we could hang out all day, every day, like you and your dad. Well, that was not a dream. You don't want to hang out with mm -hmm. all day. That was a job. Joke got us on two floors. Yeah, now. trying to get my employees to actually describe what they're doing. It's like pulling teeth. Yeah, I think mm -hmm. there are a couple of two-hour teeth guys still on the payroll. Oh my God, no. Firmness, but I'm convinced. <laughs> anyway, despite all of this, I think you and I are going to be able to get through this. You want to know why? The Bluth boys, we find a way. We're winners. Oh, you. You know, I was just checking into that. Yeah, <laughs> no, look, I, I don't know what else I can do. You know, Dad said go in there and save the company. Fine. You're really not the best father. You are not listening to your son at all. I mean, Rebel offered to buy the whole company outright. Oh, you can't do that. No, I mean, forget about that. Yeah, what if the software just never works? works? Uh. That doesn't seem like the expenses are just killing us. Hey, hang on. Uh, I think I got a solution for both of us. Oh, no. I, if I think I know what he's thinking. And open your eyes. Was I supposed to close them? No. Uh -huh. hmm? Oh, oh, because you're on the fourth floor now. I, yeah, you set up fake lock here. It's free rent. Oh, okay. I don't know. I mean, you know, this was, this was your... But thing. fake lock's not real. Our decisions were made, and you... Eventually found out about, but, but look, you know, uh -huh. this was our dream, right? To work together. Do you remember all the dreams? Except you're both did. running companies that are... Floppy and I'm about to go bankrupt and be illegal in so many ways. Yes, good night and off the bed. You know, I am just realizing that I'm still picturing you as a ten year old. Yeah, it's I weird. I was mainly trying to engineer a way to stay up late and watch the Tom Green show. <laughs> yeah, see, I don't think I'm just not sure it's a good idea, you know, but no. I'm feeling anxious enough. This is, it is just gonna be great, isn't it? It's gonna be so much fun. Stop trying to force this on him. The and only one who felt shackled to his father. Inside, outside, 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 literally. Outside, 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 outside. Hello. Oh, no. Yeah, yeah. And we discussed this. Yeah. Got me away. We can cover more ground without attracting attention. Oh. The bubble. The ball. Oh, tandem bike. Can that work? With the chain? Nope. Of course they won't. Ball. Yeah. This feels harder than walking. No, never would have fit in here. Oh, I see what you mean. Yeah. Dad's calling me constantly. He wants me to help him print things. And I, I will say the other place had more of a tech startup vibe. Yeah, this definitely doesn't. For the company will be more at home here. Yeah. If these walls could only testify, huh? <laughs> well, I'm not going to sell a bogus company to my girlfriend. Why not? It's the perfect way to end a terrible relationship. It's not terrible. Uh -huh. it's, it's a great relationship. Is it? Yes, but it won't. It's be. all based on lies. No, but that's what I'm trying to tell you. God, you're more possible to talk to than Annette. Uh-huh. You talk to Annette? That's... No. You're okay, maybe. 
And as much as we try to infuriate him, he just won't get the hint, you know? It's like, what do I gotta do? Hit him on top of the head? You already have. But next thing you know, he's back. Plus, you actually did hit him. Yeah. yeah just with a wine bottle, but it wasn't open. <laughs> I guess I could do it again, but I back to the ER again, you know, three times in one week. People are gonna start asking. Yeah. You know, elderly abuse? Which apparently is a real thing. I guess yeah. all old people are this annoying. <laughs> Somebody else. The thing is, the tech companies don't normally sell without a whole lot of vetting. Yeah. Anyone I've talked to stays on. So before we find a clueless buyer, I think we're gonna have to find a clueless president, and it's not gonna be me. Joe. Someone that's stupid. Ask any questions about the actual software. Oh, I love how you're assuming it's a he. I know, it's just it, a it's definitely. If you're gonna go for a dumb dumb, it's gonna be After your father this guy. Ceremoniously let me use the third floor, Joe. Anyway. What are you two doing down here after a long mid weekend? Well, he uh -huh. said we could use the office. He actually said, feel free to use the third floor. Um, I'm glad I gave one of those offices away. You gave an office? What? Well, it's just one of the smaller ones. You won't even know it's being used. It's what? Because an actor's body is his instrument. Come get my shower. Oh, they live in there. Oh, okay. I'm on it. I got no, it. You can't take okay. another shower. I'm still in socks and I'm about to Oh, not, not, that's not how you do shower. Gang. I don't want to jinx it, but this certainly is better than living in that attic, yes? Uh, a little better, yeah. Because you have a microwave and a fridge. Well, and a couch. Yeah, but I also bet 88 more days and squatter's rights kick in. 88 ah. squatter's rights kick in. 88 That's the, the goal in life, yeah. This is going too fast. This is going too fast. <laughs> Murphy Brown, this is going too fast. Sorry. This is going too fast. Don't do that. Stopping by here because it's where my email comes. You could check your email anywhere. Oh, yeah. yeah, email, but this is Gmail. No, I got what? Here on the third floor, and then when we move to the fourth, just, I was like, you know, screw it. I'll just come down here. To check That's ridiculous. One wire is going everywhere. Well, you can actually use your phone for that. Yeah. yeah. And I could use it, but for this particular task, I've chosen email. Job. Anyway, so what happened to Job? How many times did he hit his head as a kid? <laughs> You're looking for a president job? I'll be damned, it is a heat. Yep. Who emails Bab what? At Wednesday at nap? Hey, John, Wednesday at nap. Taylor Damon to the pub. You won't have to learn new snacks. And everybody here already knows you, so there won't be any gaining everyone's <laughs> respect. And there the best part is you get paid in stock. Right. Money is yeah. to change hands. I'm listening. Oh god, he's so stupid, That's it's it. perfect. <laughs> Can I get back to you? Yeah. I'm in. Okay, there we go. Great. <laughs> he thought long and hard about it. Face after all. This is not gonna be an easy conversation. I but think it will be. Thankful for the one who took this ragtag, talented troop of a family and, and put a roof over their head. Oh, oh, it's leaking. Long ba I need you guys out of here. No. <laughs> and we're on the move again. Okay. Oh, okay. Yeah, let's find another place in the attic. Yeah, I hate to be the one to suggest it, but I know about a tent city. Well, there you go. There you go. We're down a rung, but together. Thanks, guys. It's my first day as president, and kicking people out makes it makes it seem real. There you oh, go. Uh, something came. Powerful gay tastemakers. Oh. Gay mafia. Classic. There you go. That's the gay mafia. How do you know about that, Tobias? Very flattering. That's the real deal. You're being recruited by the this gay mafia. Good for you. Maybe this is how he's trying to reach out to me. No, I don't think so. I guess sometimes things do work out after all. So we can stay? No. No. For me. No, you're not for you guys, yeah. Things work out for me. And Good while man. things were yeah. working yeah. out for Job, Ups mom doesn't want me to see the files. So I guess this is what you'd call a don't tell gang. You see the fun we have? Yeah, fun. Printers sure. in here. What is a three dimensional? What is this? Is this the printer you sent the file to? Uh, yeah, what? I think so. Those you are... sent the file to a 3D printer? What the hell? That this is a map that they did not want me to see. Oh, for the wall. It's like a wall on the border, but made out of teeth. <laughs> She's crazy. What is it? But <laughs> Crazy. Well, that just might be a setting in the printer. Yeah, it might just be. Enter. Yeah. See right here, you have to uncheck presumed teeth. Just yeah. They need me to find money for this. Is their secret project? They're trying to get. Of course, that's what they're doing for like two seasons. Check presumed teeth and print again. Yeah. 
And as they went to do so, Job went to meet with the gay mafia. Oh, the CGI there. Green's green. Are there any tastemakers? Quick hard cement. You solely French Regency armoire. You don't think oh. you want to hear about it? I want my taste. Oh, it's no. him. Listen to this. Lucille's brother. Where's Lucille? That was me tap dancing on your grave. Wow. <laughs> yeah, I think I'm in the wrong place. No, you're not. We wanted to congratulate you on your coming out. So brave. So brave. So brave. So brave. So brave. You know what, thank you. Is this? Oh, shut up. We know you're as straight as an Oklahoma highway. Oh, I don't They're think he straight, is at all. Right? I wouldn't know <laughs> if you have been in Oklahoma. You're in Oklahoma. You're right. In the bus and truck. <laughs> you're doing fine, Oklahoma. Oh, God. Oklahoma. Okay, okay, okay. Why are we at a construction site in the trailer? Oklahoma. Is that a song? No, oh, my God. You're straight. <laughs> okay, yeah, that doesn't help. I'm gay. Yeah, sure, because of your trick. Job had recently he actually is gay, though. Also caught your appearance on that religious program, and as it is such, so also as such it is. What is it? Yeah, Auntie. ridiculous thing. I'm not being into guys, I guess. You are talking about praying away the gay. Oh, the, the worst, stupidest thing. Yeah, I, sure. I guess it could get me off. I mean, out. Uh -huh. That sends him in the hurting. Oh, right, because then there'd be less gays who would suck the gays out. No, oh, God. Because it's a man that thinks that homosexuality can be cured through shame and fear. You pathetic little dipshit. <laughs> he is a pathetic little dipshit, honestly. You said on TV you're going into conversion therapy, so you are going to go. What? And then you're going to announce it didn't work. Ah. Uh. So... I have to stay gay? Mm -hmm. Just for seven years. Then seven we'll years? Wow. It's more How? generous than what I did. Last guy who faked being gay. What? You know him, your pal, Tony Wonder. Oh. Don't worry, we took care of him, didn't we, boys? Oh, did they do the cement? Now do as you're told, and you will have made some very powerful... The gay mafia took out Tony? Hang up with your ex-wife. Sister. She was my sister. My apologies. Yeah. It was shacking up with your sister. <laughs> Maybe he is gay. Uh, yeah. I mean, I, listen, I want you to know my brother probably didn't have anything to do with your sister's. Just don't say anything. I'm not worried about it. Where is she? To be honest, we fought all the time. So oh. it's probably better if she's no longer around. Oh. Tell okay. Me about my sister and I don't know how long okay. it is. We haven't seen your sister in forever. Either of your sisters. Little insurance to make sure you will always be loyal to us. What? So good at magic. Why don't you make that disappear? What is it? Is that what I think it is? Yes, yeah, it's definitely it's what it's dead body. Oh, it's Tony. Oh, trace back to us. Oh. You it's... mentioned this hotel you saw the matinee. Yeah. Out you go. <laughs> tough, tough. I want it off my floor and somewhere no one will find it. I don't he has have to all day. Hide Tony's dead body? That's crazy. I have house seats for Tita Rivera tonight. I don't know who he is. <laughs> Tobias' your family settles in at tough. a tent city. Looks like your old man came through with that camping trip after all. Although we should stay mm. together just to be safe. Oh, so yeah. I, need to hey, I bet this place gets a lot quieter after dark. It's pretty quiet. Oh. Oh, no. oh. it's... Down the birds. Oh, my God. It's actual store tent city. <laughs> They're living in a tent in a store. It's like going to REI. Which honestly, not the worst idea. I feel like living in one of those places like REI, I feel like as long as it would be, you'd have to like, I don't know. I'm sure, I feel like they've got to check the tents or something every time before closing in case people try to stay. They've got to. But it would be like, uh, if you want to live in a place where you, there's tons of stuff there. Um, there's probably cameras though, so that's not really, nowadays, cameras, you can't really do that, but if there weren't the cameras, a pretty good living situation, food, water, definitely, oh, you go to like, a, uh, what is it, on um, the bass place, the really big ones, huge, 
that that would be a cool place to also have to if you I always thought about that as a kid like if you were stuck in the mall and like or in a store overnight I'm like how much fun it would kind of be depending on what store you were in like I wouldn't really want to be stuck in like a Sears actually no a Sears wouldn't be too bad they got beds It'd be a little boring though but like a Bass Pro a REI those are fun GameStop I always thought that as a kid and I was like play all the video games uh certain stores that would be fun some that would not be like just clothing stores would be so boring to be stuck in but a good department store or something like that yeah I'm trying to think ooh if you were stuck in like a Chuck E. Cheese as a kid the dream Dave and Buster's I would stuck in there to, actually no that would be that would be really loud and annoying honestly no place to lay down really no comfortable place yeah Alright, enough of that. That was a fun episode. I'm intrigued to see what's gonna happen next with, um, Tony's dead body, with, um, fake block, with all this stuff. I guess we'll see. So, thank you guys for watching with me. I hope you have enjoyed. Don't forget to check out Patreon. Link down below. We'll go to patreon.com slash smallscreenreactions for all those Patreon exclusive shows. So, go check those out, okay? Thank you. And I hope you're having a fantastic day, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.